Oh, well this looks dangerous. The area has been coned off. There's lots of uh, chemicals in barrels, unreacting chemicals. Since the chemicals aren't reacting, delta G, the change in Gibbs free energy, must be positive, implying non-spontaneous. Oh, but there's dynamite on the plus sign there, so if that's detonated, ah, the extra temperature given to the reaction has changed delta G in this case to be negative. A delta G negative means it's spontaneous. Let's have a closer look. Oh, you know what? This looks quite dangerous without my safety goggles. Let's run away. Over here is some rusted material. Rusting is a slow reaction, but nevertheless, it's spontaneous. Delta G is still negative. Nothing's happening here. It's non-spontaneous. Delta G is positive. Dr. Kleiner seems to have eaten too many donuts and gone into some sort of donut coma. We can't wake him. But there are rockets on his sofa. Let's make the rocket reaction spontaneous by igniting them. Delta G is now negative. The reaction spontaneous and occurs. I think we better go and help Dr. Kleiner. Let's stop him here. Oh, he's off again. Ah, oh, the reaction's run its course. Oh dear. Oh, I think he's still asleep. 